And a generalized principle then, you, you, our brains uh, are always dealing in spe each special case, and each special case is inherently terminal, <laughs> finite, <laughs> centropic, physical. <laughs> Therefore, brain wants to have things begin and end, and brain would like to have a beginning and an end of the universe, a beginning and end of, of, of the world. But mind then discovers principles which are, must have no exception, which means that they're inherently eternal and not the kind of word that brain is familiar with. <laughs> but it's implicit that they are eternal. They must have never any exception. We find then a plurality of these eternal generalized principles operative. And if you become then preoccupied with the family of known generalized principles, then you become deeply impressed to realize that these being eternal, they're all concurrently operative, and none of them have ever been found to contradict any of the others. In fact, they're all found to be inter-accommodative. They all have absolute regularities, and the regularities are inter-accommodative. 